Hi everyone, so we're going to look at how we can create this uh, readme file which acts as like a banner for our GitHub page here. So this is just going to help make it a little bit more fun and entertaining for whoever wants to land on our page. And then we can see we got a bunch of these uh, different skills listed below. Um, we can add these little markers and we can stylize it in order to customize our GitHub profile page. So I'm going to click on this. Uh, I'm just going to show you first what it looks like if I just edit it. It's essentially just a readme file that we're going to create. And you can see here it's just using standard H, um, H tags. It's using standard um, tags. So this should be like H1 tag. Commit change. Okay, so there we go. Uh, I'm going to edit this again. And you can see here h1 tag, paragraph tag, image tag. It's just using standard HTML, nothing fancy at all. And we're going to look at how we can create some of these different areas. So what you can see here is there are some custom URLs that you're just going to have to pretty much use. It's a standard template. And if I try to, let's see here, if I go to this SRC, we could see it says img.shields.io. It's a badge and we can customize it for a specific style, color, and you can see here the logo. Here we can customize what logo it is. So it's all about just playing around with these values with that SRC. And what I'm going to do if I go to shields.io now. Right over here we could see this is shields.io, the website. And we're going to look at, let's look at some badges here. So badges, uh, just how you want certain text to display and you have some sort of path and you can see you can pretty much like customize anything that you want depending how it's set up but we could take a look at this um, let's go back to the actual documentation documentation intro so we have some sort of path and we're using the base url img.shields.io and then forward slash whatever we want to use. So if I go, let's see, complete list of badges. Okay, it's still bringing me back here. Let's see if there's... Build... Badge, okay, query. So you can see here we can make it flat, flat square, plastic for the badge, social. So different ways of displaying the um, little icons. And there's logo, one of the name logos. So you can use whatever simple title icons. Let's see here. Okay, so we got simple title icons, and it's just telling you what the names of it are. So you could use those little names for the title. Adobe After Effects. Nice. So that's for those the logo. There's also logo color, label, label color, and color. Because if we look at our GitHub here, you can see here we got logo. Logo is equal to C sharp. Logo is equal to Java. Then there's logo color. We can make it white. So all these different key value pairs can be added in this URL in order to customize how we want to display um, the information in our README file. And you can see right here, I have Visual Studio Code, Arduino, Adobe, and I'm just using the same thing with shields.io. 
and I'm just customizing it based on the logo, logo color, and so on.